It is that time again where I show you some autism memes. Are you ready? Here we go. Well hello there, how you doing? Hope you're doing well and in today's autism meme review I'm going to be showing you some more autism memes that are about sensitivities that autistic people may experience. But just to let you know I do upload weekly videos onto this channel about being autistic from my experiences. So if that sounds interesting to you and you want to see more consider hitting that red subscribe button and that notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. First meme is all to do with tags on clothes. Now, this is a common thing that gets talked about in the autism community quite often. Clothes having tags on the back of the collar or on the side of clothing as well. It's just quite harsh, the material, like the labels on t-shirts, hoodies, things like that, it can be quite annoying for autistic people. And to be perfectly honest with you, it's not even the labels that are on the back of the collar that annoy me personally, it's the ones that are on the side. For me personally, I find the labels on the side really annoying because I just feel like they're just irritating and just annoying. And also some shirts, they also include a spare button on the side. It's obviously good to have that spare button, but a nuisance at the same time. And it's just, it's sensory hell for most people on the spectrum. And I can just really relate to this meme, quite honestly. I relate to that one and I hope you can relate to that one as well. Is it something that you have to deal with? You know, tags and you know, the annoyance of tags on clothing? Let us all know down below. It'd be great to hear from you. Next meme. <laughs> now the next meme is all to do with light sensitivity and this situation, this scenario, I absolutely hate it. But just to talk a little bit more about sensitivity and just light in general, it doesn't have to be just from the sun you know obviously the sun is bright but also it can be simple things such as it's been raining outside and then the clouds are gone and then the sun's out so then you've got the sun and then you've got the reflective floor because of the rain but this scenario i hate with an absolute passion literally i'll be sat down at my normal nine to five office job and um, because we've got blinds obviously they open and close usually I have them open because I like to see the outside world and think how much I would love to be outside rather than in a stuffy office sometimes when the sun's out it just goes all over the screen sometimes when I turn around it's just in my eyes even when I close the blinds slightly somehow the light manages to get through the blinds and it's just painful <laughs> To be honest, light and the sensitivity to light is just one of those things that just gets to me personally. So when I saw that meme, literally, I just fell in love with it. I just laughed. It was hilarious. Are you waiting for me? Sorry, sorry. We'll just go on to the next meme. Now, I discovered this next meme quite a few months ago, but I've been waiting for the perfect time to show it. This one. Now, <laughs> I dislike enclosed spaces generally like if I'm going to a place where I know it's going to be an enclosed space like I'm going to be brushing up against people and stuff I can deal with that because I'm going to this place for a purpose however I don't like busy places I don't like people touching me that I don't know or touching me unnecessarily like patting me on the shoulder or you know all of that weird stuff touch is a sensation that some autistic people just don't like and I can't really speak for everyone and I'm not going to. If you have your thoughts about that, let us know down below. For me personally, it's just that idea of I just like my own personal space. If people get into my space, I kind of want to know why. And quite honestly, if that was acceptable to do in real life, I would probably wear something like that because literally I just like having my own space, you know, and for people to be in my space, ah, I just don't like it. It's not because I don't like talking to people and interacting with people and stuff like that. It's just, I just need space to breathe. So when I saw that meme, I just fell in love with it. It's just me on a stick, a candlestick, a wax stick, pogo stick. I don't know why I'm talking about sticks, so we're just gonna wrap this up and go on to the next meme, which is all to do with noise. Now, noise, when there's a lot of noise for me personally, I've talked about this quite a lot on the channel, 
if you want to know a little bit more about the challenge stuff there's links down below and everything but literally when it comes to sound if I'm conversing with someone like talking to someone and there's a load of external noise maybe there's a child crying that they didn't get their magical pony maybe there's a boyfriend and girlfriend about to break up because he didn't do the dishes one time I don't know and for some reason there's music by Shakira in the background whenever 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 can be together quite honestly it's a lot to deal with I know my dancing is a lot to deal with I apologize for that not really I kind of enjoyed it but anyway noise can be just a lot for autistic people sometimes and for myself I experience it when it comes to the senses obviously sound is quite a big part of it not for all autistic people though and that's something I have to stress just because I talk about certain senses does not mean that all autistic people experience those senses I'm just bringing awareness to them so yeah that meme it's pretty good yeah it's top quality top graded beef <laughs> look at that I found Nemo <laughs> next meme shall we <laughs> sometimes when you're dealing with different stimulus or different stimuli such as light, such as noise, such as just people, you know, just different things happening at once. It can be a lot for autistic people like myself to handle on a day-to-day -day basis. You know, there's gonna be some days where everything's going right and it's all amazing. Sometimes it's just gonna be full of bang, 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 bang. So sometimes we might end up being Mr. Krabs. But actually that meme I feel has a little bit more to it. For me personally, sometimes it's all gets a bit too much you know lights are just too bright and all the rest of it but the thing is it's okay to say to yourself that it's not my day you know it's okay to say I'm having a bad day I'm having an off day or there's just a situation that is just too much to handle for you right now it doesn't mean that you won't be able to maybe it'll just be a case of trying and trying again and that's what I try to say so just keep on trying and just keep on being positive if you want to see more videos like this, click that playlist right there. Or if you want to see the other types of videos I make, click that playlist right there. But thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this, hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more. Stay you, stay indie, have a fantastic day, and I hope to see you next time.